Hello and welcome to video number four of our MT5 tutorial, guys. So one of the big differences between MT4 and MT5 is um, that in MT5 we have orders, deals, and positions. Okay, this is what changed. So I thought it might be a good idea for us to go ahead and have a dedicated video to these three things alone. So uh, this is the info I took from the website and this is the official information. Basically an order is an instruction given by the broker to buy or sell a financial instrument. Right? There are two types of orders, it could be market or pending. Market is uh, when the order is executed at current market price, basically immediately. right? And pending is an order which has some conditions and it's usually placed above or below the current market. So if this is the current market price, the pending orders are usually below or above it. A deal is the commercial exchange of a financial security. Okay, Buying is executed at the demand price, which is ask, and selling is performed at the supply price, which is the bid. A deal can be opened as a result of a market order execution or a pending order which was triggered. Right? And then we have a position which is a trade obligation, okay? the number of bought or sold contracts of a financial instrument. A long position is basically when we are expecting the price to go up, a short position is basically when we are expecting the price to go down. Um, long equals buy, short equals sell to make it a bit more simple. Now let's go ahead and think about what we just said for a second. So this is how I see it. Okay. And I try to explain it as simple as possible here. If we have a timeline and <clears throat> we start with number one, this is what we're going to get. There is a trade request generated either by you by clicking the buttons or by your expert advisor or script. Okay, that would be the first thing in our flow or the process. Then that request goes from the MT4 terminal and becomes an order in the broker server. Okay, then if successful, the order generates a deal which is sent then to the market because in some cases most of the cases actually the broker is the middleman between you and uh, the actual market okay so then if the deal is accepted the mt5 terminal opens a position okay i hope that uh, clears things a bit but um, I saw that many people have issues understanding that. So um, in the future videos, we're also going to talk about the orders, deals and positions. At that stage, we don't need to overcomplicate things. This is more than enough for you to understand what order is, what deal is and what position is. So that would be all. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next video.